I'd like to welcome each and every one of you here to Head One Agricultural High School for the unveiling of our new football coach here at IHS. I uh, thank the media for coming out on this early Thursday morning to uh, be with us on this special occasion. Uh, we just have so much going on in the afternoons with power lifting and kids going to be out that we have to do it this early in the morning. Uh, Coach Collins brought to my attention this weekend that he was going to be taking a job at Northwest Ranking uh, High School. Immediately, we began our search for our new head football coach at IHS. Uh, what we started looking for, you know, what's very important to us is somebody has a high motor, high energy, has a lot of passion for the game, most importantly, has a love for our kids, love for our community, love for our school. Uh, we talked it over with the administration. You know, we we looking for those qualities in our new uh, head football coach. There was no doubt in our minds we had that person already on staff here at IHS. And uh, you know, this guy right here has an unbelievable love for our school, love for our kids. You know, goes above and beyond. Has high energy, passion for the game. You know, and we are extremely grateful to have him not only as a member of our staff for the last eight years, but to have him be able to take the job here at the Agricultural High School and carry our football. We have a strong tradition in football, and we're going to continue to try to make that go even higher. You know, and we have no better, there's no better person to make us go to that next level than this guy right here uh, to my immediate left. So without further ado, I'd like to announce that to everyone, official announcement, that our next head football coach at Edwin American Cultural High School, Mr. Clint Hoops. I got one thing to say. It's a great day to be an Indian. Yeah, right. Every day. Every day. <laughs> I thank uh, Mr. Wago and uh, Coach Moore and the rest of the administration for giving me the opportunity to uh, be a part of this program for the years that I've been here and then the opportunity to uh, you know take over as the head coach here. Um, I've been here eight years. My family's been here eight years. We're uh, extremely rooted into this town and this community and uh, this county. Um, we love the kids here. Uh, some of them we've known since they were little, you know, and uh, it's just been an, a great opportunity to see them grow over these eight years and, and uh, see the one, you know, go on even farther and to, to watch them become, you know, outstanding young men in our community and around our area. Um, football is, is a big thing here. It is a, um, it's expected. Uh, a couple of years ago, uh, I think it was WCBI that asked me, you know, what do you think about football here? And I said, well, we're quietly building tradition. We're going to continue to do that. We're going to continue to uh, uh, raise the bar, expect more out of our kids. Um, expect more out of our community and, uh, you know, try to get this, this program or, or we're going to get this program um, to the level uh, that it sets it above and, and beyond everybody else. And that's, you know, that's why he hired me. That's why I'm, I'm wanting to uh, uh, take this the job because I know what we can do. I know what we've uh, got in front of us. Um, you know, I know the kids. I know the program. And, uh, you know, we have an opportunity to do some special things here. And, uh, you know, it's not like I'm fixing to go to work doing it. I've been doing it for the last eight years, and we're going to continue to do it. So, 